What's up guys? Welcome back to the Social Cut. I'm Steve. Thanks for watching guys. Hello, my name is Jorge Valles. Taylor here. Hey. Alright guys, so guess what man? Today we're doing the Father's Day makeover. And we got a bunch of entries and we're super happy that you guys all entered. It's a pretty cool idea, man. What do you think, bro? Hey bro, we'd like to congratulate to all the people who uh submitted their application. Is that what it was, bro? Yeah, they submitted. Anyways, I appreciate guys. I mean I, I was pretty surprised, bro. We got we got a lot, no? We got a lot. We got a lot, so this is probably I mean see how we do with this it might be a good idea to just if you guys like it man let me know put them in the comments uh if you guys want to keep doing something like this but we're excited we got the winner here today we're going to meet him in a little bit we're going to see his style get, uh, get to know him a little bit more uh we're going to take him along shopping we're going to take him shopping Hook we're going to give him a makeover we're going to give him a haircut fresh cut fresh fit air, uh, everything right all right man so let's uh let's meet the winner Hi, my name is Maribel. Hi, my name is Armando. So I entered my husband on this uh, Father's Day giveaway because he really deserves it. We have a lot of kids together and he's never selfish. He really deserves it. He works really hard. So we are so excited and happy that he won. I feel like I need a makeover because I, uh, we have me and my wife, five kids, and uh, every single day work, you know, I don't have chance to go to the store to buy new clothes. I find you guys on Instagram and I saw you guys, your, your, how you guys dress, and, and I like it. And, uh, <laughs> Some Yeezys? Ah, you guys are too lucky to go. Who's up next? Is it a guy's shirt or is it a woman's shirt? <laughs> Don't matter, I'll rock it. <laughs> it's Unisay, there you go, Unisay. <laughs> Look at this, guys. I'm telling you, man, you guys can always look good on the cheap Kohan shoes. Kohan, and they're only five bucks. Oh, yeah. oh, shit. Look at this. Double months. All right. Well, I'm getting excited. All right. Makeover <laughs> is over. That's it. I'm buying all this for myself. <laughs> Dude, look at you know what you know what bandies are? Banana Republic. Banana Republic, bro. Double months. For ten bucks. These are on, uh, for me actually. No. <laughs> What? All right, see, no, that's not gonna work. No, 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 no Crocs, no Crocs. <laughs> when, when, uh, Perfect. Right? Hey, when we said makeover, we meant makeover everything. <laughs> they got some nice suits. The key fellas is just tailoring. So they got some pretty good, as long as you get pretty close to your size, spend your money on tailoring. So let's, let's, let's get my guy over here to try on one of these. Let's try these up. Okay. We'll have a lot of stuff. I got a lot of stuff. All right, let me see. Let's try it out. So this this one's gonna be a little big. Big. Uh -huh. Oh, it's way too big. I see. So this is too big. Cannot save the tailoring. So we're gonna get something a little better. There you go. All right. See what he did here. When you wear a vest like this, you don't buy the butt in the bottom. You get it open there. See that? So you gotta leave that open. Maybe tighten it up here in the back. Maybe a little tailoring should do the trick. Turn around. Turn, turn, turn. See, so we gotta make sure we tighten this up here. Get a nice fit. That looks actually pretty good. Mm -hmm. Yeah. 
Uh, yeah, this one. All right, so I think we have enough stuff. We're gonna go take him try some stuff on. Uh, let's see what we whip up. Check it out guys, all the goodies we have here. We spent, well, I had I threw in my jacket. So that was like 15 bucks. My hip jacket, that was like came off like 43, 45 bucks. Without my stuff, we spent what 25 bucks? Yeah, like 25 about 25 bucks. bucks. And we got multiple outfits, we got some cool jeans, one other things. Don't so want to give everything away what we uh, bought. So uh later on we're gonna go back to the shop, fix them up, get the stuff worked on, and uh get vision style. Let's go. Amazing suit, an express suit from the thrift store. We got a really good deal on it. It was about uh, like 20 bucks. We actually found the matching pants, which is amazing because normally it's hard to find a matching pair, but we definitely uh, we spent a good time there, right? All right. Let's try this on here. Put the other arm down. So tell us what is wrong with this suit? So, whenever you get a suit, make sure that you have like four or three easy fits. You have the first one, good. The next one, shoulders, good. Now, the third one is how long is it? It's a little too long, so what we want, we want it to look right there so you can show a little bit of the shirt that you're wearing or the nice wash that you're wearing. After it's shortened, then you're gonna focus on the width of the suit. Uh, that way you can either rise it up sometimes on hot days and you can show off the summer look, but how is it gonna show a summer look when it's gonna fall off like that? So that's why you need a, bit, a little bit tighter. So we're, today we're gonna be focusing on the length and the width. This width is perfect already. All right, so as you can see, all right, as you can see that he's wearing the pants now and he has this break here. A break is when your pants have a sort of a break effect. Sometimes you want a small break like that. Sometimes it's you want long. sometimes you want no break. Sometimes people want ex like zero zero and it's a high like high water. So for now, we want to try on his pants to measure his pants to his body, but he can't do it with sne sneakers that he's not going to be wearing. So we're going to change his shoes into the type of shoes that he will be wearing, which are right here. And if you guys ever have a problem with sticking your feet inside of these types of shoes, it's a good idea to put on a shoehorn and then it just slides right in. All right, so the next thing that you want to do is try on the shoes that you will be wearing with the pants. In this situation, we're going to be working on the left one. When you're working on the shoes and the pants, make sure that you have it nice and tied up because you're not going to be walking around with your suit with your shoes untied. So let's make it as real as possible. So that's the first thing that you're going to do. Next thing you're going to do is make sure that the pants are at the waist and ask him, is that where you're going to wear the, 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 the pants? You're going to wear them right here? So now we're going to go back down and we fix that it doesn't look that baggy. No, I started. So right there, so that's a good that's a good length. So then you start pinning. Right there. So now we're gonna focus on tapering the pants. We're gonna 
gonna take off like two inches. Yeah. If I am, mm, let's way too tight. And then after that, we gotta do the, the hair, get the full makeover, right? So we're gonna get Armando here. He's a low maintenance type of guy. So we're gonna keep the length, uh, digging the length here. We don't wanna, look, we don't wanna just kind of burn it out, but I think this is a perfect length right now because that way it's gonna require too much maintenance. The longer the hair, the more maintenance you need to do. You comb with more and more product. So this is pretty good length right now. That way he still has uh, length to be able to comb it. And his type of hair texture is pretty straight. I tell guys all the time, if you go too short with straight hair, it's gonna stick up, it's gonna be hard for you to comb. Uh, too long, you yeah, need a lot more product, and I think right now it's pretty good length. I'm thinking like a, a one on the side here, uh, keeping it kind of mid fade. Another thing, another tip for you guys, you guys always ask me, you know, I'm a low maintenance type of guy, so I go to 0, 1, 0, 0.5, what should I do? If you want to be low maintenance, a one is good because you can't, when it grows out, it looks nice when it grows out. The shorter you go, the more maintenance you require. In a couple of days, you're gonna look, if you get a zero, you're gonna, it's gonna look like you already need a haircut, which is fine, because guys will get a haircut every week or two weeks. I recommend a zero. For guys that go longer for a haircut, uh, either a 0.5, a one, or two, or higher. Done with the haircut, we're gonna shower his hair later on. But first, have you ever done your eyebrows? Yeah. You know what? We're gonna do it today. You check it out, guys. See these long hair, nothing messes up a good cut. We got these long, bushy eyebrows. We gotta trim that up, clean up the eyebrows, give them a nice, good look. How does he look? Oh, he looks so good. <laughs> <laughs> That's you reckon? You, man. <laughs> Fellas, we spent all day working on our dude Armando. We took care of him. What do you think, bro? It went great. Uh, if you guys want to continue seeing more of these makeovers, make sure you submit that special someone. That's right, man. So make sure you guys follow us on social media at the social cut. Jorge Juan Valles. Check us out, guys. We're going to host another uh, contest. I think we did a pretty good job, man. Uh, we're feeling this contest. So if you guys want to do some more of these, let us know. Put them in the comment box below. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and uh, show some love. Thumbs up if you guys enjoy this video. And uh, that's it, right? Until next time. Bro.